Hi, my name is Patrick Muntz. I am a lending authority, I guess, in some small way. And uh, one of the things I want to talk about is transactional funding loans. Transactional funding loans are the ability for a wholesaler to purchase a property from a seller and uh, either assign the contract uh, or to use transactional funding. Uh, the transactional funding process is usually involves an end buyer uh, that has to be secured ahead of time. And it uh, also uh, requires a motivated seller, obviously, for you to find the right property. And then it's going to require an LLC or a business entity. Those are the three uh, primary things. Uh, there's three parties involved, the, the seller, the wholesaler and then the end buyer. The motivated seller would be A, the wholesaler would be B, the end buyer would be C. It's also known as same day funding, one day bridge loans, and it's difficult depending on the state to find this type of funding uh, as allowed. It's not illegal. Uh, the majority of states do have it, but those that don't um, are sensitive to use of it. It's the difference between what they call a wet and a dry closing, where the order of the closing is important. Most people want the uh, seller to uh, transfer the money to the uh, wholesaler, uh, and the wholesaler gives money to the seller, and then the end buyer comes in and closes the transaction from the uh, wholesaler. Uh, in this particular case, uh, there's a lot more latitude, and we'll go into that maybe in the future. But this is an allowable practice uh, within uh, title companies that know how it works and how to do it and how to uh, uh, bring this to uh, a happy conclusion. Uh, the reason you need it is because the costs are uh, short-term money lending or, or renting. You're renting money for a short-term basis that is giving you access to it for the cheapest price possible. Typically, four points, 3.99, I think, is uh, what, what we're, where we're at. Most people are running in the six-plus range, uh, if you can find them. And I say that used to be, like I said, a profound amount of people uh, we're doing these and then it stopped about four years ago, five years ago, and you can't find any of these people doing it now. So uh, I guess what they're doing, uh, at least for clarity's sake, is giving you proof of funds so uh, the bank uh, and or the uh, institution, if it's an institutional sale, can give you uh, a clear to close based on the ability to close. And then from there, the proof of funds are also uh, required by some realtors or other advisory uh, capacity people that are in, involved in the mix in these transactions to make sure the deal doesn't blow up down the road. Uh, the good news is there's no upfront fees of any kind. That's just not our style. And there is a processing fee, uh, which typically runs about uh, like 900 and some dollars. Uh, but it's a lot cheaper than uh, getting hit by two admin fees by uh, a regular closing. <laughs> so I think you'll find that, uh, you know, it also works for cash out refinances to some degree and ac acquisitions. And it's really good for fix and flip. Uh, if you decide to go on a short term hold, uh, we have that funding as well. So we can offer a lot of alternatives and a lot of advantages to you through these type of products, which, like I said, uh, are almost impossible to find anywhere anymore. So we like to feel that we're the people you go to when you need something you can't find or because you like us and you wanna work with somebody who's making it easy and cheap for you. And I'm gonna share with you uh, some of the ins and outs in the alternative financing world. And we're gonna talk about that. Let's start with fix and flip. If this fits your needs, we'll find something else if it doesn't. The uh, rehab property loans are becoming more and more wonky as the investors get shakier and shakier based on 
the concerns about uh, forbearance and all the other issues that are going on uh, during the moratorium. Uh, the rehab of, of property loans is good because a lot of the housing stock is pretty old uh, in Southeast Michigan. So uh, we have programs where you can get up to 100% rehab cost, 100% rehab cost, 95 uh, uh, LTVs, uh, are, excuse me, loan total uh, ratios are okay and 75% uh, after repair value. Uh, property loans from 50,000 to three and a half million, to three million, excuse me. Uh, they're short-term loans, uh, 12 to 18 months max. And I will work with people with minimum uh, credit scores of 620. Uh, extensive uh, rehab financing available. The soft costs are included in the financing so you can roll all your soft costs in for the transaction. And no prior experience required. Let me say that one more time. No prior experience required. Everyone else in his Christian brother is going to make you provide uh, a series of th minimum of three for the past 24 months. We don't do that. We're looking for customers. So uh, the interest on the draw balance <coughs> and the 18 month loan term uh, are all available and there's an optional no fee alternative uh, based on, on valuation for standard fix and flip. Uh, you, you find that that is really what people are often looking for and we can combine that uh, with uh, the transactional funding to really meet your needs. And one of the other variables is for acquisition only, we'll go up to 75% for most straight up investment properties for acquisition, 25% down. And in some cases, as low as 15% down. Uh, you can also do cash out refinancing for your business to pay off a business partner. We've got a number of uh, products that are small. Uh, long, they're both long-term small balance loans, uh, which uh, the minimum property is collateral is $100,000. The maximum amount will go up to $5 million. Rates between 55 to 9.5%. 650, we may be able to go down to 620 for loan amounts uh, that are greater than 500,000. Uh, loan to value up to 75%, especially on a jumbo, that's a home run. That's unbelievable. That does not exist on the planet elsewhere. Uh, three 30 year terms, three years uh, fixed, it may convert to an adjustable, but it's gonna be on a 30 year amortization in any case. Uh, funds in most states, and um, we'll do single family, multi apartment communities, mixed use, uh, office retail, light industrial, warehouse, self storage, no raw land or, or primary residence, however. And we can fund individual or blanket loans as well, meaning that we can take groups of your properties in portfolio and mix them down and then keep breaking them down into groups of five so you are free liquidity wise on the other properties uh, if you choose to keep them outside of the uh, of the property. Uh, the bridge loans we also have are for condo, industrial, um, people that want to do um, office, uh, residential, mixed use, mobile, mobile home parks, uh, parking, uh, income producing parking, of course, uh, multifamily, self storage, hospitality, retail, and again, blanket loans. Very popular now. People are trying to insulate themselves in free of cash. It's a good idea to free up your cash. 65% uh, to uh, 75 LTV on these uh, short, they're one to two year uh, terms with uh, plus extensions on them. We can do the equity recapture, renovation as long as the list, lift isn't too heavy on the renovation, and refinance and cash out. These are fantastic loans that are available for people who are looking for reasonably priced money.
very difficult to find today, especially in a, the, the previous credit freeze, which lasted for about seven months. So now things are thawing out and perhaps uh, you'd be kind enough to give us a call. Uh, Patrick Muntz from www.neededfunding.com.